before before kita ikam, time we minokat all all water tank, all you use all water and then it look round no more. All you pull look round no more, at all you use all swim, all cook, all drink. The salt water comes more inland. The waves are larger. Somehow the water comes in further inland, and the water lens, uh, which supplies the wells, which is the only permanent source of water for the people, is affected, and it's becoming salty. And in 2015, Urufif ran out of fresh drinking water. You couldn't. You had to drink the wells and endanger your life because you you were drinking contaminated water, you were drinking brackish water, you had to boil it. All the rainwater tanks ran dry because of the extended dry period. And it was at that point that we realized on Urupif that we couldn't continue without a permanent source of safe, clean drinking water. A more desalination plant was installed on the island at the clinic, along with the solar panels. And in 2008, that project was launched. And now, for the first time in our island's history, we have a permanent source of fresh water that we know that will be there regardless whether it's a dry season, uh, regardless of uh, contamination of the underground water sources. We have now a, a permanent solution. Technician law, water associate. One train we got a little train in Bralem. Any subject, Minamus, Missave, Solo, Missave, any part of the machine, Missave, Ron and Air. It's a very easy machine to work on. The machine is very rugged, it has very strong materials. We did the multiple trainings. So initially I trained three people. We can use like Facebook and WhatsApp and do remote troubleshooting. Yeah, we can just send pictures or instructions or they send us pictures of what's going wrong or what's a problem, and that saves a lot of travel costs. The school, I feel like all tanks to water tank. I feel like I can get some water me very clean. What's really unique about the system is it's not a big installation that requires a lot of power and constant uh, maintenance and replacement of parts. It's really, it's set up to be in a remote community. It runs on its own solar system. Um, and whenever there's sun and the batteries are full, it, it starts operating. It's very much simplified. <laughs>